You're a pro. <laughs> oh, they need to pop that. Uh, it's come back. We don't film her. <laughs> She's We're not moving the horses video. and the pimple today. <laughs> we have to like tag her. Today is the day that we are going to move the horses. First of all, I really want to say a big thank you for all the great support and very sweet messages on our other videos, yeah, I think, really for your nice. videos too, and for the one on my channel as well. Yeah, it's it was... a really great community, and everyone had like really nice words of encouragement and excitement for the future. So, thank you all. It was really sweet. Today is a very bit of a sweet day, also very exciting because I think it will be f a lot of fun over there, and for the future, a lot of other things will happen too. Um, but we've had so many memories here, so that's the the only thing that is a bit like tricky, I think. But I just had my last ride and did some other fun things with the horses, so I'm ready to go now. Gonna miss this view. Yeah. Pack them up. <laughs> no. no, but it's. Uh, I think we just do one little walk around, show the place, and maybe go through a few fun memories. Yeah. You know what? I we just can think? have a quick look here because this has already changed uh, drastically. So we're in full moving mode. All the big furniture that you see kind of like here is all staying. Um, it's only the boxes that are gonna get picked up on Monday by like a moving company. But for the most part, everything's like been packed and gone. So it already feels like this place is like starting to lose its soul a little bit. Like it's losing that little thing that made it ours, um, which is a bit sad. <laughs> yes, it's <laughs> yes, it's uh, amazing lover's neck. Um, well, you know what I also, were you in the middle of a thing or no? No, you can interrupt me again, it's okay. no problem. Uh, what I also think is the girls just grew up here. Ish. That's like, so. It's their, it's their home. But and I think they like will the adapt. They'll probably thing. adapt faster than we will. And it's like, more. Um, yeah. The fireplace is really done. Nice. I mean. Okay, okay let's go, go outside. <laughs> but where do you want to walk? You want to do a little show well, and tell? Well, the little bench there I really like, like to sit on. <laughs> I'll ask you some memories. I mean, we will be coming back to the house. This is just the horses leaving. We have like one more day. Look how nice the sun is coming through. It's actually a beautiful day. We're quite lucky to have such a nice uh, last few days here because if it was just raining also for the moving, yeah. it would have been so difficult. And it is autumn already, so yeah. we are already quite lucky. There's already some like autumnal colors coming through and especially with the sun hitting them. Do you have anything exciting to share because the garden is your place, a fun little memory to share? I mean, the asters are blooming really nicely. The asters, oh wait, can I say one thing? Me, again, we had people visiting here from the UK and I wanted to be like, oh look, these roses are, I said Austin Martin, I think. Aston Martin, you call oh, them Aston Martin roses, but they're David Austin's. Yeah, Aston, well, that's a car. Yeah, Aston yeah, Martin is so a I car was wrong. Um, What are they called? David Austin. Yeah, but why did you say something else then before? I said the asters are blooming. The <laughs> Let's keep, keep going. <laughs> keep going before we get too sidetracked. So, so all the stables are like, empty kind of like they've been cleaned and they're they're done we just have to remove like the forages um and like everything above pretty much has been removed oh yeah excuse you food in there they're having a little sniggity snack get out and look this one <laughs> hey not with your crow oh, great <laughs> brand new croc at least it's the same color <laughs> tack room's empty now there's okay. only a couple of things Can left. I, this is one of my favorite places because I was just always here with the horses. There's a little radius of music and I was sitting here. I mean, also brushing, but also sitting here. Which is always very nice. Yeah. I know cute. you didn't it like was, this It's never my favorite because like my horse didn't really fit in here. Um, but I, I could appreciate it with your horses and stuff. Chaos, it's basically like no complaining. And I was already here. I think we'll leave it here. Hmm. Yeah. As an omen. You can already open her up and get her ready. <laughs> so we have five horses here. Only two fit in one truck, of course. So we have to see because we don't want only one horse to be left here. Um, and we were, oh. It's empty boxes. Ah. <laughs> anyway, so we have to see how we're gonna do it. I think we're first gonna move Andres and Macho. Then we're gonna get beer. I oh, think. I thought about doing, because Annie will lose it, so I think it's easier to go do Annie and Chase. Okay. And then just bear, and then Antara is a macho. Okay, let's do that then. Because Annie's really attached to bear, so she won't be too happy if he leaves and she's here. But we're just bringing them quite late on the day so they can just, for tonight at least, chew in the stable and settle down. Yeah, they'll just go straight in the stable. And they're pretty chilled horses. I mean, Chase already spent some time at that stable. 
and he knows it, Antares knows it. I think Andorra's the only really biggest chill. issue that is going to happen in the first few days is going to be Antares. Yeah. Because he is very attached to Macho. Yeah, he gets like and separation anxiety yeah. a bit. And here he is already in a the different stable block when he's in the stable, but normally they're always together. But hopefully it will be okay. Yeah. So and one good thing about being there is we, that we can hopefully have him with other horses and there's a little bit more yeah. going on there. So hopefully he will learn to be not too attached to only Macho, but also with other horses. Yeah, I hope that helps him among. Look how beautiful. Can you imagine I just breathe in a bee? Any special memories here? I go here. There's here were like the chickens, very clear memory. Yeah, we had the chickens. Oh, nice. <gasps> oh, look at these zinnias that came out. Oh, no, zinnias. Look how nice they are. So this is like... <laughs> I knew you were going to do that. So this is like a... Um, oh, I've broken the zinnia. Um, so this, oh, is a, this is a new area that we planted. It used to be... Oh, it used to be... <sighs> so annoyed. <laughs> It used to be like for the chickens, and then all of our chickens sadly were eaten by a fox. Hey. True. Yeah, okay. Let the people know what happened. It's true. They were not here when that happened. No, they were not here, but they got eaten. They had been moved, but they got eaten. And so we turned it in, into a wildflower meadow. And this was, it was really cute. We enjoyed this a lot. And there is our arena. Really, yeah. really nice arena. I really like it there always, just riding. These Very are the cute. trees that caused us to have a huge lawsuit. We will not be missing. I mean, we'll be missing let's the trees. Let's keep this video positive. <laughs> I'm just, there is a lot of memories. Yeah, of let's do bad. the positive memories. So what do we do with this now? This fencing was a great memory. We touched on it already, but yes. we designed it ourselves. That was fun. Okay, well, we need to grab the halters then. Otherwise, it's never going to happen. It's quite sad, isn't it? To think that it's all coming to an end. Because especially, I think this place was is kind of a dream place so never did i ever think to live with my horses and this is the first place we lived with the horses yeah for quite a long time so it is sad but and it's also been so normal for us to just look out like the windows of the house and see the horses here i think one good thing that they Mace, um, leave it. have is that they are together like they're moving as a herd. Yeah, they're all moving together and they're getting in the fields like all close to each other and together. Yeah, and what so. I then also think, it's also nice for them because horses in the wild will see a lot of different things. Here they just see the same thing for the years. So then they see something yeah. new. And in the, in the not so distant future, there will be an incredible place for them. Yeah, then Not that this place isn't incredible, but there, there's, a, a, there's a bigger goal to, the, to all of this. Then, okay, let's get them. Oh, I'll be here. Chase is already coming. Hi, Chase. <laughs> Hey, big boy. Hi, on. You ready to be moved? He's already getting such a winter coat. Yeah, I know. This is how you know that they're like always outside. Look how sun bleached the, the halter is. Maze, don't do that. Not again. Covered in fox pee or some sort of like cat pee. You are a dirty mouse. It's not the first move we've done, huh? This is five <gasps> minutes instead of across the world. <laughs> this is what I did at Hank's place too. Oh no! She's always had a lot of energy for even now for a 28 year old. She's like a three year old. 29. Oh, 29. Oh gosh. 30 next. Come on, race go. Nice. It's always so different when you go from like a stable, like a sports stable, and then here the, the horses are like 24 7 out in summer, really. So they get into a whole different state, and especially because Chase is like semi retired. I always think the high difference is very cute. You ready? Guess so. You ready, buddy? Time for our next adventure, huh? I am a little emotional now, I have to say. <laughs> because you know, once we put them on, this is the last time they put hoofs on this ground. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Oh. And he is scaring oh <laughs> Penny's like ruining the emotion for him. Good Aww. boy. Well done. <laughs> He's very hungry. <laughs> See you. The final hoof prints. Off to the next one, Annie. She's also been to quite some places in her whole life. Yes. Come on. I think so. There we go. All right. You obviously have to re have already moved with Chase from Australia, which was also crazy. Yeah. So in Ani, I haven't moved too often. I was always everywhere. I mean, most of the places are very long time. Um, but I think usually they take just two months at least to really get used to it. 
I mean, I think so. It depends on the horse. I mean, with with Chase, when he moved, it took like over a year for him to get settled. Yeah, okay. Do you remember? He like dropped but so much weight. Like Australia and the Netherlands. Yeah, so I think it just depends on the move and the type of horse you have. I think Andorra will settle quite quickly. I mean, she's been like so many different stables with I mean, your shows. Yeah, with the shows. Yeah. You've arrived. New home. Yeah, it's a good thing they know the place already. There she is, Miss Andorra. All right. Good boy. They look very humble. It's really cute. Yeah. Yeah, these are your new neighbors for now. She's like, oh lord. <laughs> this is Gaio. Oh, so strange they're now here because we've been here for so long, but not with them. Hey boy. Oh. <laughs> Chase is like so. Strong. One thing that I straw. really, really like actually is because Andorra always was on straw before. She loves Good straw point. and she is always like doing a little housekeeping there, playing around with it. Here you have your whole clean bed. Gosh, she definitely looks big here. I think it's because all the other horses are quite small and Chase is like 180. Look, she's eating already. Oh, she's very cute. She's already looking outside the window a bit, eating, snacking, doing a little thing. Chase, how is he? He's, quite, he's chill, he's just having a look around. I, I'm <laughs> glad that we have really like chilled horses so they really don't care about stuff like this. They're, they, they're used to a lot more. Aren't you? You can look, Chase is there. <laughs> She's like, I smell him, but I don't see him. Okay, I think it's time for us to get the other horses. Uh, so they're all here together and it won't take too long for the other yeah, horses. Yeah, we'll make it quick. And then? We, uh, we see how they're all going. Then we have a long time with them. Yes. <laughs> I think we put Bear in that little like um, small rubber uh, paddock that we have first because I think he should go in there with Macho into the stable. Into the other stables because they're staying in the, like the second stable block, the smaller one. So I think it's better if we do that. Also then he can eat a bit of the grass in the meantime. Yeah, he's already upset because Andorra is not here. So we'll get him quickly there. This tiny, cute little halter. Also, they all need new halters. Like, this farm life halter stuff is really good and cute for here, but now that they're moving there, I think we need to upgrade their things a little bit. Okay, go get them. Come, Barry, we're growing. New adventure for you as well. There he is, little Barry. Everybody liked your outfit, by the way, in the other video. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, he's eager. <laughs> How long has he been here for? Four years? He came the first year we moved here, so I think five, no? Yeah, we lived here for like five and a half years now, I think. And then they are still waiting. Then it will be so empty here. Yeah, that would be really strange. Already like this, we've never seen it for five years with the three gone. Because when you leave for shows and stuff, it's just two that go. Mm, it already feels really empty. Okay, next trip. Oh, he peed. Oh. Uh, come. So they are going in another barn just for now. This one, it's actually behind here. Behind there. Um, but just for a little bit of time because some horses are still leaving, so then we will have more space in the bigger barn. But they will be together much on him. Should we put them tomorrow in the garden of our apartment, like here? We'll see. For maybe. a little bit. That could be nice. I think I'm just gonna put him in this little, um, pen here until Macho comes, that way they can go in there together. And he's got a little bit of grass to start mowing down anyway. How cute, there is the window of the apartment. And you can just see Bear. Look, straight to work. <laughs> well done, Bear. But this is nice for him also. Yeah. Oh, just wanted to see how they're doing, but look at Annie. <laughs> She's just eating and staring. Oh. What a beautiful girl. It already feels a lot more quiet over here. It's time to get on to us and Macho now. Wacht even hoor. Come back now, man. I don't know how I did that. I washed him after the ride today, so I'm like, he's gonna go into the stable all clean. Hmm, good. Macho looks quite clean as well. It's more my boys that were dirtier. Okay, boys. Time for you to, to come. He's smelling. Come. Very happy that our horses load quite easily. Mm. Yes, it's all very interesting, Macho. No, this way. All right. Okay. 
So I'll put him already in the stable or with the beer for a second in the paddock? Oh, I don't know actually. They'll make a lot of noise in the paddock. Maybe first in the stable. Yeah. Is Antares waiting on here? No, you can get him off. And do I go to a stable? Yeah, we just have to see how we do it because Antares always gets very... Just if you walk already in there and then I'll take him out when you're out of sight. So much will be in here. And it's also a nice stable and look here. It's where you look into kind of the back yard, yard, the back garden. So we will have a little pedestal here so you can look outside. Beer is coming too, okay? Ani is like always in love with beer. So. But who's that screaming? <laughs> yes, much. They will get a little step here, like a pedestal, so then they can also see each other a bit more when they're not outside. Okay, so all the horses are here now. <laughs> How cute. The two little halters. <laughs> Two should small we, halters, two such big characters. Should we quickly go have a look how the others yeah. are doing? Oh, it's crazy seeing them all here. I don't know how, but he is the most relaxed one out of them all. Andorra can hear beer and she really likes beer, so she's a little bit upset still. There's like her adopted son. Oh, she's like, I'm gonna go to him now. Yeah. I'm sure she will have to settle a little bit. Of course it's the, it's, of course it's the 29 year old that's the most excited. Oh, I'm so Chase is a really cute, soft <laughs> Winnie. That was very cute. I was like, Chase, look, he's yeah. looking outside. And Antares I have to say, really Antares is actually doing really, really good. So hopefully... And everything will just have to take a bit of time and then they will be okay. Should we just be here and help them and see what they need? Maybe some like snacks or something else? Yeah, we'll just help them settle and stuff. And then uh, I'm sure we'll be fine. We'll have dinner here tonight in the apartment so we can keep an eye on them and then... Uh, yeah. It will be good. And then, well, tomorrow they will go into the field. Yeah, so and then, then they can I'll also uh, all see each other. So this is it for now. If there's anything else, I will definitely show you in this video. And otherwise, we keep going tomorrow when they're yeah, in the field. Yeah, otherwise we'll see you guys in the morning. See Probably in the morning. morning. Hopefully. Yeah. It is the next morning. <laughs> hey. And it's time for them to go out. How are you now, dance? Hey, <laughs> have a good sleep. You look happy. Put some nice hay there. Hey. Usually when you want look at the stable, you can also see. And he's been pretty calm, otherwise everything would have been moved, all the straw to one side. Yeah, you guys are going out into your new fields. And how are these boys? Happy eating. Hey, bear. Are you ready to go out too? Yeah. It's time for them. Uh, to go out, they seem all okay and happy. Yeah, and then maybe especially today, it's good when they go out one of the first. Yeah, because then it's not like everybody passing and yeah. Okay, I'm pretty excited for them to explore the new field with lots of grass. You ready? I always change usually with a new field. He's fine, he'll just have a little run around, but when he's fine. He does at home, what I always think is so cute is that when he is in the field with more grass, he just trots, eats again, and then it's like he's running to get more grass. Good thing about this place as well is that there's hardly any flies, because yeah. there's a, a lot more wind. There's an ocean breeze, this is what I was telling you guys, that it's just open oh. land out here. Look how open it is. Walking with a stallion. Lots of grass. I'm surprised they're not they're walking eating very grass. quickly. Sorry, walking very quickly. Yeah, there they go. Oh. Now it's time for these two to go together. We keep them together, especially for now, so everything stays the same as much as possible. Also, don't mind my outfit. We didn't have any clothes at home. I don't even know where you got that from. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> well, I think there's one thing they like for sure, and that's all the grass. Good boy. Antares hasn't even bothered exploring. This is the big test. Will Macho go under the fence? I don't think so. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, yeah there they are. Oh. Good boys. Lucky last. Oh, bear here. Hey, your turn. Good boy, bear. He's very chill. <laughs> this is for you. So Bear's gonna be able to be in his diet field but still see all the others because they share that whole fence line. But that grass would not be good for him. And I'm hoping that this grass is already not too, gonna be too much for him. <laughs> the others are already keeping an eye on him. Well, I think this is a, a good setup. They like close to each other, seeing each other. And I'm very happy and proud of them how well they did because it's already quite a stressful period. Um, and they definitely stepped up and were pretty easy, don't you think? Yeah. So Still pretty chilled. We were very tired after it yesterday because I think it was a big thing to do in our minds, at least for me. And now it's nice that that's done, but it's also crazy. And now we have to clean up the house a little we bit. We have more. a lot more to finish off. So and the whole day is going to be very busy. Yeah. And I think the whole night too. But then we'll be checking up with them throughout the day and also at night and I will uh, show you how that's going to go. But for now they seem super chill. Uh, we will not be super chill the coming few hours. <laughs> it is evening. We are tired. We're tired. We <laughs> used all, but we're all good and happy. The horses are chill. Annie also looks a bit tired. My liver. My cutie. Hey. How was your day? Hmm? Exhausting. <laughs> so they've been out for a long time in the field. They were actually quite chill. I think they were very they, good. Yeah, they're really good. Like, I think it's really good that they... Well, I know it's really good they moved as a group, as a gang. I mean, of course, everything is a bit different now. And also for them to now go here and stuff instead of home. But it will all be a process. So what do you think? How did it go? Well, I think Chase is looking, is it possible he's already gained 100 kilos from one day? <laughs> oh my gosh. Also, the guys, him with a, uh, he gets a really thick winter coat, which has already started. <laughs> but he's literally not even touching his hay. Wait, hold on. Here? I think they're really full. He's just, he's just like, this is how I feel after dinner when I go on the couch. Like this. He's, he's had enough. So far, so good. We've just been very busy and it's been very extremely hectic yes. moving. We thought we were nearly there and then it still took hours and hours and hours. There's been no time to, to take anything in. So I think over the next couple of days, we're just going to enjoy the horses and let them settle and kind of start to realize what happened. Should we go to the little ponies? Yes. Hey, March. Oh, you have nice straw in your hair. It's always so difficult to see him because he's black. As you saw in the other videos, we have the... In the other video. Uh, we have the other feed room there, but I made my own little feed kind of area here as well with some supplements. It's still a work in progress, but it's getting there. Um, and the rest we settled in with most of the stuff. But I have to be honest, we still have a lot laying around that we yeah. have to tackle. Exhibit A, hello mower. Hi. Uh, and here's little beauty. Um, so he yeah. looks good. So they seem... Oh. 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 <laughs> hello. Wow. Oh. Want to show off for the camera? For the moving part, I think knocking on everything. Everything went really well. I don't think we could have asked for more. No? No. I'm They've happy. We've been doing good. Uh, we kept an eye out. The people here kept an eye out because obviously we were still moving. It went as good as it could have gone. Yes. So now we're going to wrap it up in a beautiful bow and go to sleep for the next four days. Yeah, well, we'll sleep for a few days. <laughs> There's no time for that. No, there is uh, not. But we'll start feeding all the horses now for the like last night time food. And then... I'll stop touching this thing. And then it's time to go to bed. So, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope that you liked this video. I really liked showing you the process and there's a lot more to come. But the horses are here now. There's no way back. It's all done and hopefully it will all work out. And be here? Yeah. But they seem happy and we are ready to go to bed now. So thank Yes, you. so let's wrap, wrap her up. <laughs> okay, let's feed them and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, bye. Macho, uh, he seems very sweet and he is very sweet, but as I said, he's <laughs> Okay, stop! <laughs> <laughs>
Indeed. God, that would be the end of you. I'm just doing the last and very final big round here at night. Dress because I do not make sense and it is really not a problem. Tidying it up again. Uh, uh, we have had like help in it and everything. For you, I mean, if I was doing things on here, but I want good normal fish. Maybe we should do a challenge with macho and beer, and then we make a little course. <laughs> I think he's already doing so much better. <laughs> <laughs> and he saw it. They lost. How much? <laughs> Amazing. But I didn't realize it was all from the side. It's really tall right now, isn't it? Huh? It's. No, no, don't break! Get off the grass, yes sir. Yes sir, get off the grass. Oh, god damn it. Just, okay, don't break now. <laughs>